Hi all, welcome back to my channel. I'm B. I have today another quick tutorial and this time I'm going to explain how to move vectors in their forward direction. In this scene, I have two actors. This first actor moves with constant velocity and this one moves with acceleration. So every frame will go faster and faster. Let's play this. This one has the same velocity. Really, really slow. And the other one goes faster and faster and faster every frame. Both of these examples are just simple actors and both of them move in the forward direction. Let's take first this with constant velocity. Here's the blueprint, nothing special about this, this is just a, a simple actor with a root scene, component and a mesh. And also this arrow element which helped me to detect what is the forward direction. It's very useful, so I highly recommend to use this uh, component. As I said, this is nothing, nothing special and this is how I like to do things in Unreal. So this, for example, is with constant velocity. We have the root scene component and a mesh, static mesh component. This is not essential, you can use whatever you want, you can apply this code to any kind of factor. Uh, this is my way to do things. Next thing I have is this U property, fit for the movement. And I like to expose this to Blueprint so I can edit that in the Blueprint. Everything happens on the tick, so every frame. And the code is very, very simple. First, I get the current actor location. And then I use the get actor forward vector. This will give me the forward direction of the actor. Multiply that for speed. Um, very important to multiply that for delta time. So it will be frame rate, frame rate independent. And finally, just take the new location to the actor. This get actor forward vector will give us this this direction over here. In Unreal, the x-axis is the forward direction. If we play this again, we will see that we'll go on that direction. I can rotate this, for example, that way, and then it will go on that direction. I can rotate, for example, this way, this way, we'll move up. This simple code, if I go to the properties, I can just make it faster. That's crazy. Okay. Let's try this again. We'll go faster. Let's check this example next. This one starts slow and go faster every frame. Go faster and faster and faster. If we open the code, the blueprint, it's exactly the same. We have a root scene component, a mesh, a static mesh component, and the arrow to check what is the forward direction. So we have exactly the same thing. The root scene component and the static mesh component. How do we move this object? Very simple. In this case, I have this U property, so I can modify this acceleration rate on the blueprint and the current velocity. The current velocity will start in zero always. The way we move this object is very similar to the other example. First, we get the current location of the actor. Next thing is we add this acceleration rate, which is always the same value with the delta time to this current location, velocity. So this will start in zero 
uh, will go up every frame. That's why the actor moves every time faster and faster. And next thing, we just need to update the location with the same, with the actor forward vector. Remember that the X axis of the actor. And we apply the current velocity. And finally, we set the location again. Okay, so we can do the same. We can rotate this object, for example, that way. We'll start slow and go faster and faster. We can go to the blueprint. And for example, make it a little bit faster, say five. Goodbye, little guy. That's all for this example. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and press like. And if you want to receive any notifications, hit that bell button. Thank you all. Bye.